Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you and tell you in an awesomely easy tutorial how to make an iced latte with the Nespresso Cities coffee machine. Once again, this will be a full tutorial, but also a super duper easy peasy tutorial. So let's get right into the video. <clears throat> now, luckily for you, the Nespresso Cities and Milk coffee machine, I'm just gonna turn it on, um, comes with the coffee machine and the milk frother. And basically those are the two things that you need to make your iced latte. Now I love iced lattes on a nice warm summer day. It's the perfect mix of like a warm and a cold drink. It's incredible in my opinion. So basically here's what we're gonna do. First and foremost, um, while you're sort of getting everything ready, you should uh, go ahead and you should froth some milk. I already did that. I just put the milk in here and I press this just quickly. I just, I'll do it now just to show you. I literally press the button like that and it turned on and I let it complete its cycle. I'm just gonna turn it off because the milk is already frothed. But you wanna do a warm froth. You can hold this button down for two seconds to do a cold froth, but you wanna do a warm froth. It'll give you a good balance between the warm of the coffee and the milk and then the cold of the ice, okay? So as you can see right here, we've frothed the milk oh my goodness that looks so good okay next what you're gonna do is open this up get your coffee pod put your coffee pod in there close it so it's ready to be used then you want to get a mug and put some ice in the mug as you can see right over here I have some ice in the mug and that is gonna form our iced latte okay so then you can choose to do um, either a short espresso or a lungo shot depending on what you want um, I like, to be honest with you, the, the short espresso with this. You can do a Lungo, it's up to you, but for this specific drink, because there's ice in it, I like a short espresso. Plus, for the video, it keeps the machine running a little bit quicker, less time of, it's, it's you know, it's not the quietest thing, so, you know, it keeps it running a little bit faster and not, not as long, okay? So I'm gonna push this button right here, and basically, it's gonna brew a short espresso into here. Look at that, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, I like, I always love watching the ice melt too because it's so cool. Because the coffee coming out is so hot and the ice is so cold. Even just an iced espresso, to be honest with you, on a nice summer day on the front porch. I'm not gonna tell you where I live, but this bathroom, this is my basement bathroom, is literally under the front porch. So literally, I'm sitting up there on, and my neighbors know, I'm sitting up there with my coffee mug and my Nintendo Switch after the kids are in bed. My wife usually stays inside. I go out there alone. Kids are in bed, house is calm. My wife's maybe even asleep on the couch. And I'm out there with my coffee mug and my Nintendo Switch just chilling, just enjoying the night. When I'm not filming, because obviously I film many nights as well. Okay, anyways, as you can see right here, Oh my gosh, I, I'm gonna totally drink this after. I don't think I should have another coffee just yet, but I'm probably gonna just maybe leave it in the fridge for a little bit and drink it later, just delicious. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take this and we're gonna add in our milk. I'm gonna try and do this with one hand without spilling anything. This will turn it into a latte. So just give me a moment here. I'm gonna try and do this without spilling anything anywhere. We're gonna add in our milk uh, to your desired amount. And usually, usually I would get that froth there too, but I think here, I'm gonna pour some of this milk out until I get to the froth, okay? Please don't tear me apart for pouring out milk, okay? Because I made a video a long time ago on using a specific type of a, of a um, I won't even go over what it is because I don't want you to go look it up. But I made a video when I, I let the water run for a long time, unfortunately, I didn't think about it. And I literally just got torn apart in the comments for leaving the, run, the running water for so long. I mean, you can go look it up. It was how to use a six bath. Um, because my wife had to use the sits bath after her first pregnancy. I believe it was after our, we had our son, our oldest son. We have four young kids. Um, so after her first pregnancy, but it was only three pregnancies because the youngest two are twins. Anyways, side note, um, don't, 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 don't tear me up for pouring out a little bit of milk. I work hard. Okay, I'm not going to defend myself. <laughs> I'm trying not to, but it's like an automatic reaction. So let's just, I, you guys are going to tear me up for sure. For sure, I'm going to get eaten away. Anyways, I'm going to get out the nice... Um, if I had two hands available, I would just scoop it on myself. But I'm going to try and get out that froth. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Anyways, you get the idea. It's hard for me to get out. Um, I'm tempted to use my hand to get it out. But I feel like if I use my hand, people are really going to tear me apart. If I stick my hand in there and start scooping out the froth. Um, you know what? Go for it. Ah, honestly, go for it. Go for it. Ah, like, really? <laughs> Come on, you know how many hateful comments I get? It doesn't even bother me anymore. So anyways, just like that, 
absolutely delicious. You know what? Let's just, why not? You guys are just going to eat me alive, okay? And the coolest thing about doing it this way is that you feel the balance between the cold ice and the warm coffee. So anyways, <laughs> how did this video turn from an instructional video like that to me stirring coffee, with stirring an ice latte with my hand and knowing that people are probably just going to tear me up, but it is what it is. It's all good. Go for it. Do your best. Anyways, that is how to make an iced latte with the Nespresso Satis. Sorry that you had to see me use my hand and pour milk and all that other stuff, but listen, we do what we gotta do, and I can't wait to just drink this bad boy. I'm just, oh, I can't wait, but I'm not gonna have it yet because I'm already still pumped up from my morning coffee. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna drink this one a little bit later because I don't wanna be at a level 10. I like to keep it at like a six or seven. And if I'm at a 10 for energy, this is me at a six or seven. If I'm at a 10 for energy, I'm like a bulldozer. Like literally, I'll go through a wall. So that's why I'm gonna save this for later. That's it. Also, people are like, how much coffee does this guy drink? Just so it's clear, I have two, maximum two coffees a day. Sometimes I'll have one, maximum two. I already had my morning coffee. I'll save this for my sort of evening, you know, 6, 7, 8 p.m. one. Um, just so it's absolutely clear. People think I like have like 10 coffees a day because of my energy levels. But honestly, um, I'm just so pumped up. I love life and I'm just, you know, I'm very happy that I, I get to do this. Um, you know, also I'm a full-time teacher and that fulfills me as well. Believe it or not, even with a channel this size, I'm still a full-time elementary school teacher and I love that job as well. Um, you know, so that's truly it. And that is, yeah, you know, a lot of people are like, what? No, there's, there's no way this guy's a teacher. I am. Yeah, you can go look it up. I'm still at this time, at the time of filming this, I'm still a full-time elementary school teacher. I don't know in five years if like, you know, what I'm going to be doing because from this channel, my life has taken a turn in such an upward trend that like literally it's taking myself and my family to places um, emotionally, financially that we could have never dreamed of. So I don't know what the future will hold, but for now, yeah, I still teach full time and have this channel as well, which is basically another full time job. And I'm a great husband and a great father of four young kids. Just so it's clear, I, I take care of all my responsibilities. But that's a side note. Sorry, this video is supposed to be probably about two minutes long and it's much longer than that. But hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you like this video tutorial slash finger stirring in the coffee video, please be sure to give it a nice big healthy thumbs up or at least we'll go like this. Give it like a finger down like that. Anyways, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below in the comments and uh, make sure you comment below because I'm telling you, there's no way I'm doing this video like this and there's no way it's, it's not getting comments. I'll tell you right now, make sure you comment whatever you're going to say, good or bad, go for it. It's all good. So let's try that outro again. If you like this video tutorial slash explanation slash demonstration slash finger stirring video, please be sure to give it a nice big healthy thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.